All right, so I'm recording this from my other camera, and it's a little uh, slow, and um, it's, it just won't go on YouTube, so I'm just doing it like this, and this is the second time, so everything I said before, I'm sure you could imagine. All right, okay, God wants normalcy, okay? Now, um, very cold in here, decked up, 37 degrees, oh, no, no wind, no door to lock Anyways, this this is this is the um, a thumbless sort of interpretation. Okay, um, east meets west. So God of the far west and God of the far east are both glamorized. They're both sort of all oh, that. Oh, they got some really good people, you know, technology and uh, compassionate entertainment and, and you know yada yada, you know, the entertainment and the humor. Okay, so the 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 God. God of the East and the God of the West are are basically the overlap. Okay, now what you got here is the Great Divide. So you, you don't have a true Great Divide, really, except for America, where East meets West. You have the Middle East, I guess you have it, but it's sort of an ancient sort of. Um, uh, it, it's not as important as America, which is so new that people sort of say, "Oh, that's I don't want to," you know, none of that, please, you know. Okay, so the East meets West paradigm is is where where they're, they're, they're the Great Divide, and then it's kind of like a tongue finger twister here. What you have is is this this theory of of, of where you have you have to you know you can't just pray. It's not going to just pray because we're talking mountains that are are jagged. They're they're not. You know they're they're impassable. That's that's you know there's no holy mountain is going to cross the impassable because they come on boats and stuff like that. And, and America, the east, what, the east coast, the west coast, the left, the right, uh, get into the political cop out scapegoats, looking you know oh the president's to blame. He's he's the only one we have to you know dethrone or something like that. Okay, so instead what you have is this theory of of east meets west. And and these are threads, if you will, these these ones who cross who cross that great divide. Not the ones who cross them, but their children. The children are the ones that you cannot see. They're the thread that comes off. That you pull that thread out, and that thread on the old world will bind that. It'll, it'll solve fascism and and create create unity. So so with this East meets West thing. The Great Divide comes in, comes into the East meets West, and these threads that they come around, and you they're kind of going on this this sort of cosmic ellipse, ellipse of soci sociological theory of conservating morality very much. That that morality is that th that threads tie down point. So, so what I was gonna say is like religion. Religion is like, oh, and we are so confident, and we have no hesitation. You know, well, science hesitates. That's why the the lights are on, okay? Because science lights the lights, okay? God, we thank, you know, we can thank God. We can say, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But it's it's really going at at an angle, okay? You're going going downhill. The manifest destiny goes goes out. We think it's going up, but it really once it crosses the mountain, it kind of goes down. You only go up when you're in a ship, okay? You're, you're, you look up and you see the stars. There's no trees and whatnot. Um, so, <clears throat> the, you know, the, getting the steam engine, like uh, Arthur, so Arthur Solaris, uh, this is Arthur Christmas. Will there be a Christmas? <laughs> only if Santa gets his butt off the, off the, uh, off the other cultures, Reality, okay? So, um, these threads, they must, they must go. They must, they absolutely must, but we must not know about it. Because to think about it is sort of thinking, um, 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 that's what we're thinking is, um, you, you don't hear the, uh, the holy man going, and, um, 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 <laughs> right? No, the scientist, he, he says that. He, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so the threads, they come off. They come off, they they must be drawn, okay? Uh, fabric, we're wearing clothes. The Industrial Revolution 
created clothing, right? And without that clothing, we're like animals. We're naked. And there's no sails. There's no wind to fill our... There's, the wind doesn't have any sails to fill because we wove that. We didn't, you know, use all animal skins. <laughs> I guess, uh... You know, that's... It gets savage then, you know, if you if you if you ignore those threads, those threads and you start saying, Oh no, everyone must go, you know, type of evil stuff. In reality there are there are um simple compassionate technology on top of the policy. So the policy is the thread. The technology is the general happiness. The 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 safety, not knowing that, knowing that um, you're not tying, you're not, you're not weaving the, the the evil, the evil fabric. You're you're doing the, the cloth from the most holy geographical reality, the paradigm. Combing your hair too, right? It's not the same thing. I mean, you, you want people to comb their hair? You have to pull the threads, and they're invisible. They're uh, they're they're finer than finer than nanoparticles. They're 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 like the threads of of, of spirituality and and community. <clears throat> and so um, it's gold too. <laughs> um, okay. And um and um and um and um 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 is is the blank expression the. The, the blank expression is to take those threads and move them. Don't don't let them move because they're gonna go in the wrong direction. They're gonna get all like shaky. They're gonna get they're gonna freak out. Okay. So we take those threads. We we say okay. These are the threads. These these are the, the invisible threads, not the ones that we're wearing, but the ones that that fill our our minds and our whole our, our our hearts, like the threads coming out of our eyes, if you will. There are no threads coming out of our eyes, but we are we are receiving. You know, we're sort of uh, experiencing technology, experiencing culture, experiencing geography, and this is okay. So, if you want, if you want people to pray, if you want people, you want uh, fascist dictators to to um to be woven up to be tied down, you know, so to speak, to, to, to keep the balloon from going, blocking out the sun. You have to use these threads. You must, you must use these threads. I try to be the blank expression because I know a lot of people are like, that that's what they want is, is no expression. Okay, so you must take these threads and these east and east west areas, these cross the great divide, and, and they 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 are in this another this other dimensional paradigm. These threads that come off the children of the first generation across the great divide. You take them around and you tie them up, and you weave. You, you basically weave them, and you use the the general happiness technology to say, you know, let, let's let's find a way to open the door without there being without there being degradation, demonic sort of realities, and let's not, and if we confuse them, we can't have a let's, there's not going to be a let's, it's just going to be a, a da, do, or whatever, so, East meets West, these threads are imperative, they are, they are imperative, I, I, I know expression is, is something that people people use to, um, to convey sort of urgency and that urgency is something that you know the, the general happiness are they're just gonna go oh no no me 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 you know we have and there's not even gonna be a we okay there is no we until we have this fabric until we have until we weave this this fabric and we, we do them at the same time. They're the, same, they're the numerator and the denominator. The denominator is geography. The numerator is general happiness. General happiness. 
that that is it. Okay. Uh, high, high intelligence, you know, keeping a, a very straight, calm face from the new world. Camera. That's that's imperative. Okay. It's it's. it's you can't even freak out about it. You can't even... It's catatonic. It, the threads the threads come out and they just kind of lay, lay there and you think, oh, isn't that wonderful? It's like the Golden Gate, you know, just this catatonic sort of thread just sitting there. People are like, yeah, I'm jumping. Uh, and at the same time, we find some general happiness. Some of these uh, defective people, undesirable people, who are saying, oh no, I, I'm important, I am important, you know. Um, so, uh, it, it's, it's just absolute, this is pure science, okay? It must be, it must, there, there is no nothing, there is nothing without, without this wool, this weaving fabric, we, these, these ephemeral sort of uh, cosmic, sociological, cosmic, geographic, cultural, normative threads being being actively drawn out from, from if you will, the silkworm of the Far East, the, the, uh, the child of the child of, of manifest destiny, who is not happy where they are. They they are the, the thread who left left in place as a catatonic will become a tripwire of, you know, oh, just do whatever, you know, just, you know, don't talk about that, just do drugs or something like that. Don't talk about the, uh, the thread, the, the geographic, cultural, normative, secondary normative thread. People do not want to hear about it. And if they don't even see it, if, if they're not experiencing it, then we have much better compassion, much better, much better voice, a loud voice, who doesn't want voice, who does not want that, general happiness does not want that, and, and, the, the, the great divide, the, 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 the fascist rationality, We'll, we'll look at that that disconcern, that pathological, unwoven thread where, where we start to say, oh, let's let's take these weak threads, let's take these defective threads, and they'll become our uh, our sympathizers. That that is bad, and it's because of the cosmic thing. Okay, there's this one sort of unit, one sort of element, sort of. Sort of uh, particle paradigm, positive, negative, you want the positives to connect, you want the negatives to be grounded, grounded in general, general technology to ally these, these components, to ally the threads and the general, the general grounding and the allied, allied circuits. Allied. This is fascinating. I'm just coming up with this right now on the camera. 37 degrees, all decked up, ready to go to the coffee house because it's 5:58 in the morning. <laughs> and, uh, it's cold. Um, and what this does, this 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 allows the technology paradigm to really work beyond this these sort of these. You know, you in, you have your, your general grounding that needs to be grounded. In technology, and then you have your uh, you know, your nations, and you have your threads that are coming off, pointing, seeing, coming from your eyes. You know these threads, if you will, that are that are that are, are geographic, cultural, secondary, normative realities. But then in the middle, you have these. Uh, oh, my children will be married and go to college, even if they're junk, right? Even if they're even if they are dogs, and I don't care about these threads because I cannot see them, and then, therefore fascism will, will come in and sweep up. Um, and then you also have this middle thread. I just came up with this one right now. It's it's the engineering engineering sphere where pragmatic design, where you must have 
rationality. You must, you know, people, people want to build and build and build. They're not realizing there's, there's limited um, components. There's little, limited high quality material. So you have to use it minimally. You can't say, oh, I'll just buy up, I'll just get all the high quality material because that's not going to happen. You know, someone's going to end up with the bunk stuff and someone else who, who happens to be married to the mob or whatever, married to the, the culture or the, the institution who happened to, you know, find that connection because they were floating above the compassion for the, for the general, you know, um, ungrounded, ungroundable cult, cultural sympathy of, of defects. Of saying, oh, it's different. Oh, isn't that wonderful? You know, it's, oh, it's inbred or something like that. You know, these general, general groundies, they're not grounded. We're gonna we're gonna ignore these threads, these threads that can just cause chaos. I was talking to Arthur Schwarz when uh, I just saw the movie Fantastic Arthur Christmas. Yeah, he's good too. <laughs> um, like like both my grandpas almost, or my dad and <laughs> my mom's dad. Yeah, uh, I'll accept I'm the king. Um, Santa. Okay, Santa Cruz. The cross, okay, so, and on the cross thing, I was talking, I was just hearing the radio NPR, they're talking, uh, Indiana is the crossroads, okay, so the middle of America, but, but as you go manifest destiny, you go out there into the west, and if the hand starts to go up, you start to think, well, what's going on here, you know, the west coast, the, the cultures, that is the tip of the culture on the west coast, the cross is kind of like driven you know the Holy War driven into the into the continent. It crosses. It, it tries to cross the the Great Divide, but it can't. It's it's like only a thin thin line, a thin engineering thread. This this politicized. You know the highway. It's the highway. It's highway sixty six. Very sort of contentious. Go west. Do not go. You know John Candy. Do not go east. You know do not. But these threads. You know you, you can have fat fatso marching west and saying, ah, what are you, what's wrong with you? John Candy, you know, paint your wagon out west. But these threads that come off there, the children of, of those, they're, they're going to tie, they, they're not going to do nothing, okay? There's, there will be nothing without these, these woven components, without these woven, There'll be nothing without these woven components, okay? I'm trying to, I'm making eye contact with the camera because, on the West Coast, so many bad things, so many ignorances can happen from the individual prime case at the tip of the cross, the spear point, that, that thread that comes off that the tip of the cross, the, the sort of he heaven to, to heavens, you know, heavens to Murgatroyd. Well, that... See, I just lost it there. Okay, so that, the, that, was, that star at the, at the end... And, and it could easily raise its right hand in the wrong way and start thinking, you know, general destruction instead of general happiness. It, it's these these histories. These are simply histories that are are unwritable because they're wrong. Okay, unwritable wrong. So you have to take that wrong and tie it down and say, okay, what was going to right? What was what was the fascist element? Not the, uh, the, the, the concept. Where did that concept, where did that thread come from? How did that thread go out? Okay, so I was, yeah, the threads, they go out, and, and they can become destructive, okay? It's, it's simply saying, oh, those, those general components are ungrounded, so our nations are going to uh, find some sort of um, pounding, you know, pounding down of gen general happiness. General happiness, okay, so if you've gone this far, general happiness uh, comes from gene, uh, general happy, genetic, yeah, that's that's an evil word, I, whoever made that genetic, the word genetic up should be sterilized, okay, um, but that would be good for them, that would make their life better, and so, post-genetic equality or engineering not engineering. It, it, the word, the language is a little. Um, the concept is is that the people who are unground need to be grounded in some sort of reality. It, it says, okay, they're not gonna, 
we're not going to be producing defective people. We're not going to be producing evil, defective people because we're going to ground. We can find a grounding thing. We can say, "Hey, look, if you if you volunteer to be in this clean camera, in this this good natured thing that, that the threads are coming off." And, and the ground is grounded. We, we, we have general happiness is about everybody being married. So if there was no if defective people, criminals, or just very undesirable people, if they were all married and they could be happy where they are and truly happy, these ideal relationships, you know, uh, uh, def uh, developmental. Uh, psychotic, all these people, if they should not be in these, they should be in co-ed institutions that cost almost nothing. If they want to kill themselves, that's that's their nature, basically. And but we can still nurture the good possible, the good potential, and have them have take that that highest star that starts way up there. And bring it down by the thread. It's like a pulley, if you will. You, you're pulling, you're pulling the threads out. You're saying, okay, let's 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 neutralize the east meets west. Create God, lift God up into the into the stars. And at the same time, you're bringing another star down, a nice embryonic star. And you're bringing that down all the way down to the ground, all the way down, lifting the star, bringing bringing the other ones down, and saying, okay, we have these grounded points. We're going to put that star in their soul, Not, and we're going to give them a soul. We're going to say, here, here to un give desire to, to the undesirable, okay? And, and literally, like, bring a baby down. The, ba the, the, the teenager is escaping, and, and the little baby is coming down, and he's going into that general that general happiness sphere. He's, he's uh, she, he or she is... Is going to is going to be like a Moses, okay, like a great leader or something like that. And at the same time, these these stars that are going up, these these teenage stars who have who have been in hell, you're lifting them out of hell because not because they're generally defective or primitive, but because they are in the wrong place. They are in the they have crossed. Their parents have crossed the great divide, and they must. They must not be there. They must not be there. And if you say that must not be, then that that's a rationale for fascism. So fascism simply says, oh, well, we know that they must not be, so let's, you know, let's go on to some final solution type of thing. That, that can be balanced by having that wheel, if you will, up at the top, that, that invisible wheel that simply works on policy, of identity, you know, saying, ah, oh, I see the star, we can follow this star, and we can use this star as leverage to pull up, pull out the rationale, and bring down, bring down God down to the very ground, okay? So these stars, these stars, these embryonic supernovas are coming down all the way down to the ground, but they're, ha they're safe. They're very safe because it's all, very, it's all rather slow. It's, it's all very, it's kind of ambiguous. And and in this and in this blissful ambiguity, we, we have this sort of potential to pray. This this <laughs> I know it's one hand is white, one hand is black. You know, so praying, right? Praying because we know that sight, the the nothing is being woven and it is bringing down a, a blanket, a blanket with. with an embryo, embryonic concept, a baby, all the way to the ground. These these defective people are like, oh my God, it's a baby. Let, let's, we, you know, we 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 gave our souls to God to because because we knew they knew uh, they know that they're defective, and so they take say let's let's do the easy. Thing the PG Easy Post Genetic Evolution Social Engineering PG Parental Guide PG Easy Easy to bring those stars down all the way to the ground, lifting the stars up, 
the threads are coming out, they're tying around, and fascism is saying, okay, I, I am, I have no, no rationale for fascism. All, all the, the elements are rolling. And not, not saying it, it, you cannot really talk about this. It has to be in motion. It has to be, it has to have inertia. And this inertia, my, this inertia is going to, is, it's just going to, it's going to, God's going to be like, holy cow, these people are good, they care, they're, they're bringing, they're bringing the message down from the heavens, and at the same time, with the same energy, they're bringing the stars down, and they're lifting the, the, the threads up, the threads of the cloth. And now my feet are cold, and I'm going to the coffee shop, <laughs> trying to get warm. And, um, and, um, thank you. Thank I love you guys. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ow! Yeah. Ow! And I'm, I'm, I am fucking serious. And I don't like to use bad language, unless if we have war or something like that. If war is if war is what people want, that that's bad news because then we're gonna have to burn all the history books, right? Like they did in Japan, you know. So um, so a million sews sew the fabric. Those threads are going to mend the holes in the fabric. They're going to sew it up, and and we're gonna ground. Ground God, we're gonna pound the, the cross into the ground and the flowers. We're gonna plant. We're gonna bring the seeds down, God seeds, and plant those seeds at the base of the cross. And they're gonna be beautiful. And they're gonna say, "Oh my God, look at this great, look at this, look at this great caring world that that we're we're growing little little precious flowers growing up on the side of a stone cross." Or a monument, or something that needs to be reconstructed. These flowers, these 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 these, these PG, the guide, the, the parental guide, PG post genetic happiness. Happiness is what we want, what we need. We actually we don't actually want happiness. We just need it. Okay. So we have to have that wheel, that wheel of policy is <laughs> like literally spinning in heaven, okay? And is it is its idea is to take that thread and pull the thread out of hell like, like silk from a worm, like like polyester from oil. You know, you don't want to go into an oil well, but you take the material out of there because it fuels our our greed, it does. The oil, we're like all addicted to the oil and the petroleum, the energy, the lights are on and nobody's home. Well, if you take those threads out, you're opening up the door and you're at the same time using that same momentum to bring down bring down light into the very darkness place where, where light is most needed. And yet it's not going to be blinding light. It's not even going to be a spotlight shining in your eyes. It's going to be love coming out of your eyes, okay? <laughs> so uh, that makes me very happy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So Arthur Solaris, Brendan Moriarty. Ah, uh, 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 thousand, a thousand thank yous, a thousand God blesses you, or else we must have that wheel, the big easy, the the social safety. A net to do this process, okay? <laughs> yeah! Yes! Absolutely! Okay! Well, <laughs> yeah, it's all his happy times! <laughs> so, um, alright, so, see you on YouTube! <laughs>